letter case permutation right so guys in this question we have a string we have a string right we have a string like this and what we need to do is we need to generate all the possible letter case permutations for particular string so what is a letter case permutation so a letter case permutation means we can we can change the the case of particular character of our string right so one of the one of the letter case permutation for this string is if we change the case for letter a so it to be capital a 1 capital b uh, 2 right one case could be this one case could be we will we will not change the case for uh, small a uh, but if we change the case for capital B, so it will be this. So one one letter case permutation can be this. Uh, another one can be can be this. Capital A one small b and two, right? So what all possible uh, letter combination letter permutation do we have for this string? We have like four four uh, four uh, permutations. One can be this, second can be this, third can be this, and fourth one. Uh, is this itself right so we have total four uh, letter case permutations okay now the thing is how we will find this uh, permutations so to find this permutations I will going to use backtracking right or you can simply say recursion but precisely it's a backtracking problem right so okay so this problem is a very good and easy example to understand uh, backtracking right okay so see how we will how we will find how we will find the uh, letter case permutation for this string. See, okay. So a small a one capital B and two. So what are we gonna do? We gonna iterate over the string, right? And if we found a character, then we what we will do? We will change, we will change the case of that character, and uh, and create a new string, and. Uh, we, and then what we will do we will do this for all the remaining characters recursively right see see don't confuse don't confuse see let's say we are at uh, this this character right we will start from this character so uh, it, its case is lowercase so it is in lowercase so what we will do we will create this character this character as a uh, into a uppercase character so we will create it like this capital A 1 b2 now we will come to next next character because we are recursively calling uh, this uh, this string right so we will come to next character of the string so it is not a a, a letter so we will do nothing so we will come to next uh, uh, character so it is a letter so what we will do we will change its its case so it is a capital b so we will convert it into smaller b so capital a 1 smaller b 2 ok now we will come to next element of the string so it is not a letter so we will do nothing and we will return ok we will return from this now we will come to next element of the string so since it is not a letter so we will do nothing now we will come to this so see this is this is a letter so what we will do we will change its case so since it is in upper case so what we will do we will convert it into its lower case so the string which will uh, become like this so capital small a 1 small b 2 ok so earlier we were here so we will come to now at this so since this is this is not a, a character right so we will do nothing and we will return so uh, what all permutation did we get we get this uh, like this one this one this one and this string in itself is also one of its permutation, right? So we have a one b two capital A one capital B two capital A one small b two small a one small b two. So we have this. This is four uh, strings, right? So this is this is our answer. And this is how we will we will uh, we will find this, right? So let me show you the code of this problem. Okay. So see guys code is here code is here so this is this is our function we have this this uh, string as an argument 
and what is the return type of this function the return type of this function is string of list of string right so what we have in this list of string we have all the permutation possible permutation for this string okay letter case permutation precisely i should say so what i'll do i'll create a resultant uh, list of array type array list type and what i'll do i'll i'll, I'll call i'll create a, a function called find all permutations and i'll pass our resultant uh, array list our string and a zero as an argument right so what all these three things this is our array list uh, our output array list and this is our input string and this is our start point right so first thing that what will first thing that we will do let me let me uh, write that case up in there okay so first first what we will do we will add add the word into our uh, resultant uh, list so what we will do we will add this into list so a 1 b 2 this is our resultant list next what we will do we will we have start as 0 so we will uh, what we will do we will break break the string into a character array this is word array and check the ith character of this array is a letter or not so this is not a letter this is not a letter okay so this is not a net letter actually it's a it's a character so what we'll do we'll change its case so we'll change its case so it is a 1 b 2 now what we will do we will increment our i so see once we have changed its case this is what we are doing we are changing the case and now see what we are doing since it was it was a upper case so sorry it was a lower case so we'll convert it converting it into a upper case here and and what we are doing we are recursively calling this function and passing this resultant array list and and string and this input string and the start pointer now is i plus one so earlier our i was zero and plus one is one so we will start checking uh, or converting our string from from this from this not this right okay so this we will do recursively right this we will do recursively from there we will create string like this sorry small b2 and so on right uh, it was similar as i have showed you in algorithm part so uh, at finally we will we will construct we will construct or we will create all this four possible uh, possible uh, letter case permutation of this string and we will add all these this permutation in our resultant resultant list and at finally we will pass this this list back right so this is nothing but the code of this problem right okay so i hope you guys now now understood how how to write the code for this problem right okay thank you so much for watching